How are we doing guys? Luke here of Simbox in association with Clint Patrick and Adrenaline Performance. And this is the short and snappy Simbox prediction for Joe Smith versus Maxim Vlasov. Goes down this Saturday headlining the top ranked card live on ESPN and it's for the WBO light heavyweight world title. Joe Smith, he is 31 years of age. He's got a record of 26 and 3 with 21 big wins by way of knockout. Very experienced, and he goes in with an even more experienced opponent in Maxim Vlasov. He is 45 and 3, 21 big wins by way of knockout. On the record of Joe Smith, he's got three losses. He's got a couple of losses on there via points to Sullivan Barrera and Dimitri Bivol. And early on in his career, back in 2010, he was knocked out in his seventh fight. In Vlasov, he's got three losses on his record as well. All three of those losses coming by way of points decisions. The three losses on the record of Maxim Vlasov are via points to Isaac Chalemba, Christoph Glowacki and Gilberto Ramirez. With Joe Smith, he has some really impressive victories on his record. He holds a knockout victory over Bernard Hopkins. He's the only man to have stopped Bernard Hopkins in what turned out to be the executioner's final fight back in 2016. An impressive first round knockout of Andre Fonfara in the very first round and he's also defeated Elder Alvarez and Jesse Hart so some really good solid names at 175 pounds. Maxim Vlasov on the other hand he's had 48 fights he's been a professional since 2005 but he doesn't have the strength and depth in terms of top quality opposition he's beat some fringe contenders and some undefeated opponents but the best name on his record arguably is Isaac Chalemba he shared two bouts with Isaac Chalamba and went one and one. Both guys picking up points decisions in both fights. So leading into this fight on Saturday night, the, the original date was postponed to a COVID, a positive COVID test for Maxim Vlasov. So it was delayed up until April 10th. It goes down this weekend. My prediction, I think this fight is tailor-made for Joel Smith. I think he's the younger man, but he's the fresher man. He's had a lot of less miles on the clock than Maxim Vlasov and I think that will tell in the ring on Saturday. There might only be three years in between both guys in terms of age but in terms of boxing there's a million miles on the clock with Maxim Vlasov and coming off the back of a positive Covid test as we've seen in recent boxing action we're not too sure how that might affect boxers moving forward. We've seen a number of boxers most recently Alexander Povetkin he tested positive for Covid last year and he just wasn't right in the ring against Dillian White in the rematch this past March. So my prediction, I'm going to go for Joe Smith. And he is a big puncher, but Maxim Vlasov is very, very experienced. He knows how to last the championship distance. So I think Joe Smith will land a lot of heavy shots. I think he'll be in control of the fight. I think he'll be on the front foot and he'll take centre of the ring. And I think he'll win the majority of the rounds. So my prediction is going to be Joe Smith by points decision, unanimous points decision, and he will be the new WBO light heavyweight world champion. Let me know in the comments below if you agree or disagree with my prediction. Do you think Maxim Vlasov can cause the upset? Do you agree with me that Joe Smith becomes a new light heavyweight world champion and puts himself in line for some great fights down the line with the likes of Atta Paterbiev, a rematch with Bivol, or some of the undefeated British contenders like Lyndon Arthur or Joshua Boatze? or even the experienced Callum Johnson. There's a lot of big names there and some great fights to be made for the winner of this fight. Check out Simbox across all social media. Big shout out to our sponsors, Adrenaline Performance and Clint Patrick. Check those guys out on Instagram and I'll catch you on the next one.